this as well. Scale that in. Pull it down a bit. Yeah. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to give it, actually, scale that in a bit. I'm going to give it a bit of sharpness. Mm, so we can scale the whole lot in. And scale that in a bit. Okay. I want to give it a unique shape. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hit extrude, change the axes. Um, yeah, this manipulator here actually does have all three methods of manipulating polygons. You know, you can scale. If you click that, it's going to bring up the scale in the middle as well. That's a rotation. If you click that edge there, it's going to bring up the rotator. And if we move, what we want to do is we want to scale in. Scale in a bit. Right. Maybe scale that in a bit more. Um, hit G to repeat that. And then we're going to flatten this out. And let's scale that in. Right. And now. Hit G again, and I'm going to fly the blade up. And let's scale that in a bit. And scale that in a bit. Give it a nice edge. Okay. Let's check out what we've got. Nice bit of detail in there. Yep. It doesn't quite do what I want it to do. So I'm going to select that edge loop I made. And really push it in. Maybe push, um, pull these vertices down a bit as well. They're a bit high. Maybe these guys as well. Okay. Actually, no, they're really low. <laughs> In fact, I'm just going to select that and that. Don't want you. I'm just going to pull that shape down a bit. Pull this topology down. Okay. Smooth. Yeah, because every um, new piece of geometry you create, it's going to, by average, well, by de um, default, it's going to have hard normals. But yeah, that looks, that looks pretty cool. It's got a nice bit of detail in there. Mm. Uh, maybe if we add a an edge loop actually, add an edge loop there, and scale that out. Maybe that'll give it a bit more of a, a bit of oomph on there. You know, to kind of define what we're trying to define. I suppose when we texture this, it's going to have like a really dark texture in there. You know, I'm going to add. I'm going to add um. Some more edge loops all along this blade just to kind of break it up. Um, and I kind of want to clean up, clean up my geometry a bit. And I think the last bit to do is to create a cool looking bottom half. Um, I'm just going to add like a huge spike. Shape this in real quick. And yeah, that was G there. And shape that out. Um, we can pull this edge out as well a bit. Actually, maybe if you pull them down as well, that will create a spike. And scale that in a bit. Okay. Alright. There's our weird knife. 
well, you know, stabby thing. Mm, I might, yeah, what I'm going to do is now, I'm going to go to my um, front view. Um, you can get that up by just pressing space. And I'm going to delete half, just so I don't have to do, well, just so I don't have to model when I'm using the scale tool. Uh, I'm just going to bring that in. Maybe rotate that a bit. Okay. Hmm. Not something. Yeah. <laughs> Too tempting. I'm gonna add another spike right over here. Sorry, what does that look like? Something like that. Okay, push that down, pull it. Do the same with those vertical vertices. Mm. Bring that in nice and tight. Cool. Maybe it's a scale that out. Okay, let's check that soften those normals up. Mm, doesn't look great. Mm. Mm, no, nah, it's not going to work, is it? Frame that up. Press the F there. Okay, maybe if we edit this bit here, let's pull that out a bit. This is basically what modeling is all about then. It's pushing and pulling points until you get satisfactory. Okay. Cool. Let's just pull that one out. Let's check it out. Okay, I think we're about done here. Hmm. I suppose that is a bonus about half in your model. You can see more of it. But yeah, that's 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 good enough for me. Same process. Duplicate scale in the X. Um combine oh tore that off there. Select half your model. No, it's not it. And control and drag. Uh, last bit is to hit merge. Um, just like I did before, I like to I like to um, just move it. It's fine. Let's go back to our little poly. Alright. So, that is our weird blade we have modeled from our, well, my head. Yeah, maybe. Let's kind of straighten up. Yeah, we can scale to that. Just for the sake of when you're painting. 